uh, David McClure, and I think Jenna's assisting with uh, sign interpretation. to object to the closing of the Rickerton bus lounges. Uh, I haven't seen any reasons for doing so outlined in the plan. I know that they've experienced some problems there and it hasn't been well maintained and the plasma screens have been offline for some time and haven't been repaired. It's a really useful space. It's a safe space at night or when it's cold and it's good to be able to get into the warm. How do you move to the next thing here? Can you use the PowerPoint on here? Oh, great, thank you. So it's a safe environment, and for, it's going to be useful for the long term. And will provide a lot of benefit to the local community. And it, I, I don't know what the data collection's been like, but it doesn't seem like there's been data collection about how many people are using it. Um, it's not been well maintained, and I know that the, there's a letter missing from the sign outside. It, it just hasn't been restored in all this time. And the CTV, uh, CCTV plasma screens have been offline for a long time, for a while as well. Um, there's been a cafe that's been running really well there for the last year, and there's a new cafe open nearby, so it's good for businesses and good for the local community. <laughs> And having the um, Metro Mart system there has been really useful. You're able to top up your cards there using the machine. And the area has a lot of traffic going through it. It seems like it's a facility that will be used more and more in the future and can be open for longer hours so that people who need it can use it. <laughs> so I think there needs to be some regular data collection about how many people are actually using it before it can be decided that it can be closed. I don't think that's been done so far. And it needs to be better maintained for the long term so that people can use it and encouraging people to use it more so that people are aware that it exists and it can be used. And it's of long term benefit to a, a large community. Thank you. Deb, thank you for your submission. but. Um, are you, uh, do you, you use the bus lounge yourself quite frequently? I do, yeah. And, um, and, and you find it very, very good to use? Yes, I do. And some initial problems, you saw those get uh, steadily better? Yeah. 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 Okay, uh, Yanni. 
thank you for your submission. Um, did you think there's a need for bus lounges in other parts of the city? And if so, what other locations would you like to see them? Yeah, I think it would be good to have them in different places. Having just along Ripton Road's not very much. All right. Are there any other questions? Thank you. Thank you very much. Yep. Thank you. Great.